Things were hotting up at the Millennium Estrel Open on a national holiday on Tuesday as fans poured through the gates for more first round action. Welcome to the Open! <laughs> and many of them headed quickly for Court Kashkais, where former world number one Leighton Hewitt was back in competitive action alongside fellow Australian Alex de Menor. And it was a successful return to the tour for Hewitt as he and his 19-year-old partner outplayed second seeds Michael Venus and Raven Klaassen 6-4, 6-4 to move into the quarterfinals. I still feel like, you know, if I play with some of these Aussie guys, uh, especially the younger guys, that, you know, it, it helps have a connection out there, especially when they're playing Davis Cup for me as well in, on the big stage, and I get to know them a little bit better, how they deal with certain situations under pressure. Um, and Alex is going to be you know, a big part of our Davis Cup team moving forward for a lot more years. In the battle of the qualifiers on centre court, meanwhile, Italian Simone Bolelli was motoring into the second round, wrapping up his 6-3, 6-2 victory over Portugal's Joao Dominguez in some style. The match of the day would feature two men who'd had a busy start to the week off courts. Local hero Joao Souza had been out catching waves. While Daniel Medvedev had enjoyed a hair-raising tour of Kashkais Marina at a Peugeot track day. But now it was time to get serious as the Portuguese number one went in search of his first win in four attempts at his home event against the eighth seed from Russia. And it was looking like it would be Medvedev who would emerge with the opening set when he led 5-3, only for Souza to raise his level just in time. He broke back, forced a tie-break and raced through the shootout, converting his first of five set points to move ahead in front of a passionate sellout crowd. In the second set, again, Souza had to come from behind and when he converted his third break point of the game at 5-all, the finish line was in sight. Moments later, he stood at match point. And quickly wrapped up a tense and emotional 7-6, 7-5 victory to earn himself a second round meeting with fellow Portuguese and namesake Pedro Sousa on Wednesday. Yeah, it feels great. I mean, it's fantastic to, uh, to come back here and to, to win finally. There's been tough years here for me and uh, yeah, I think I played a great match today. I was very very confident on, uh, on my tennis, I've been playing good tennis, so yeah, it was a great start and uh, hopefully we can, we can play even better next run. In the last singles on centre court, Greek next-gen star Stefanos Tsitsipas was back in action after his first ATP final in Barcelona just three days earlier, when he faced recent Marrakesh champion Pablo Andahar for a place in round two. And it was the 19-year-old world number 44 who notched up another match win on the clay to win himself a meeting with top seed Kevin Anderson on Thursday.